it's Miss Elise. I'm here with a fun and easy science experiment that you can do at home. As everyone knows, spring is here, which means we're having more sunny days, but also a lot of rain. So what's making all of that rain? Well, it has to do with the water cycle. So you have evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. What's evaporation? When the water that's on the earth gets warm, it changes from liquid to gas. The gas can go up into the sky where it condenses. It makes a cloud. When that cloud gets really heavy and full of water because the gas has cooled down into a liquid, it comes out as precipitation. That's our rain. So if we just have a little bit of water vapor that goes up into the sky and fills up the cloud we get a little bit of rain. I counted about one drop per second with a little bit of water. But I wonder what would happen if we used a lot of water. You can make a hypothesis. How many drops do you think you could count in a minute when you use a little bit of water or if you use a lot of water? Let me know how it works out at home. All you need is some water. If you don't have food coloring, you can use um, a little Kool-Aid packet. Also smells good. You need three containers, cotton balls for the clouds, and a, a holder. Um, if you don't have one of these, you could use a cup and punch some holes in the bottom. So have fun. I miss you all and hope to see you soon.